Hello. Guess who's back? Sorry I've been away for a long time. Been doing my university work and I got a bit bogged down, so I stopped doing these for a bit. But we'll get back to it. And I'm hoping to be able to do an hour each time. And then um, I can get on with playing some more games. I've still got a lot on the list of games I'd started but not finished. <laughs> so we've got a way to go yet. We'll see. Hunting things down. Going back to the camp and all that stuff. Although the camp hasn't got much money, has it? Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? <laughs> Eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. <laughs> sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. <sighs> You gonna take the old man into town? You can take us too? Why, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. You <laughs> ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. I think I know which way to go. Look, there's, there's a little yellow thing on the map. It tells me. Yeah, honestly. Sometimes in video games, eh? Woo. Ladies, sing us a song. <laughs> oh, gold. Screw him. <laughs> I'm not helping them. Charity, the fool can get his own horse. 
I don't believe you're quite that cold, Mr. Morgan. Oh, I'm colder than you realize. I feel bad I didn't rob and kill the bastard. <laughs> Very inspiring, Arthur. That son of a bitch Ooh. deserves a noose. Smell those yeah. sheep. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around. See what we got here. Go left here, down the main street. Stairs always on the right. Sure, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. The hell's the matter with you? All right. Here we are, just like I said. The cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> with pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. Imagine Paris and Valentine. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Afternoon. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? Yeah, well, I got no money on me. Okay, wait for me outside when you're done. Plenty out on the shelves, but I got more out back. Deciding if I'm going to sell anything. It all looks so good, doesn't it? <laughs> so, oh, so, sold some coffee. For once? You feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? The lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. Well, look at this. A jaw harp. What is this list of yours? I got a lot to replenish after that god-awful time in the mountains. All done. Thank you kindly. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. Okay, that'll do. Yeehaw, back outside. 
That's what cowboys do, isn't it? They go, yee-haw. <laughs> oh, here's to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out there in New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? Uh, I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get off of me. Get your hands off of her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey. Hey, take it. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Go away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. My wife Claire. What in the world is happening to this place? Can I help you, sir? A bath, perhaps? Sir! I don't care at all. If I had the microphone on all this time, you've been hearing me making noises. <sighs> oh, uh, can I help you, sir? No. Wrong room. No harm done. <clears throat> that could have been awkward. Please don't bother the other guests, sir. Some people. Ooh, music change. You know what that means, don't you? Now, oh, get the hell out of here, will you? Sorry. Wrong room. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just me and. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but it is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? 
Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get! I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Just bone it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. I'm as good at riding a horse as I am at driving a car, aren't I? <laughs> In other games. Ah. Oh. Telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Don't mess with me. Come on, my girl. That was that was me being quite vicious there, wasn't it? Ooh, I'm all I'm ever so butch. Go to the map and decide what we're gonna do next. Off we go. I'm so butch. <laughs> yeah, some nice views in the game, isn't there? Then I've got myself an Elgato device now, so the, the video quality should go up a bit. I should be able to start doing live commentaries because this isn't live. I played the game previously and then had to add the voiceover afterwards. That was the way I used to have to do it. But once I've got Red Dead Redemption 2 out of the, of the way, hey, I can start doing Lord. live stuff again. Am I glad to see you? You pay up, but we keep up. Hey, you! Where's my horse? You said Ooh, you something gone. It'll find its way back. You, you bought from your Driscoll boys. You paid the Driscoll mm -hmm. boys. I made it right with you, I swear. Well, I guess you forgot about the interest. Now it's on, boy! Oh, sweet Jesus! This is me doing low profile. <laughs>
stupid horse. Oh, that, that was a wasted effort, wasn't it? Whoop. He didn't see that. Shit. We'll see about this. Oh well, I seem to have murdered somebody by accident. <laughs> I guess the low profile's over. Oh, and I'm dead. Oh, that worked well, didn't it? <laughs> Look, I'm 20 minutes into the game before I died, so... <laughs> See if anybody still notices that I'm, I'm a murderer now. There's my horse! See if I can go into town without killing somebody by fall falling on them. <laughs> well, there's some touchy bastards around in this game, isn't there? Piss off. Boy, do isn't it? Who's going <laughs> piss off? Ooh, we get to go in the saloon. Very, very cowboy way of opening the doors there. Arthur, Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it Are easy, you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, oh, and then we have our <laughs> answer. <laughs> An authentic Western bar fight. You're gonna be able to do. You're gonna do it sometime, haven't you? This one's a bit of a son of a bitch, isn't he? Oh, he was. Thought I did that to him. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna get up now. Punch, punch, punch. Get him. Smack. Oof. He ain't getting up from that. We can deal with these fellas. Go get higher. Tough guy. Uh. You want some too, huh? Come on, pretty boy. Pretty boy? You're kidding me. Pretty boy? Pretty boy. <laughs> Your damn skull open. Not if I don't get to you first. Yeah. Yeah. I got 
Not scared. Son of a bitch. Smacking. Oof. Don't let him hit me. Come on, that's it. Oh, I don't know about. Oh, help. In the nuts. In the nuts. What it team? Hey, come on, stop that! Stop! Stop! Please! Please! I beg you, stop! Come, sir. You won the fight already, surely that's enough! What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! <laughs> Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. So that's cleaning up, is it? Got some water on my face. Covered in dirt, but hey. <laughs> go on the map. Find out where we got to go. We'll go for that one. Do all of the quests. Where's my goddamn horse? He's never around when I want him. Off we go. Home, home on the plane. We'll get copyright struck for that. It doesn't matter really. It's not as if I'm monetized or anything. Yeah, take all my money. I don't care. I don't have any anyway. I've got about sixty pounds to my name now. Ah, oh, great. Hopefully, I can sort that situation out soon. It's not as if this channel's ever going to make me any money, is it? <laughs> I'm definitely not the next PewDiePie, am I? But then I'm not racist, so... <laughs> okay, I shouldn't have said that. I'm probably never going to be the next PewDiePie now. Because PewDiePie, I hate me. But I'm going to try and keep putting stuff on the chip channel just to keep it going. 
I did have a little bit of a blip in the viewing figures a while back. back. Mainly on a Minecraft video. Not Minecraft, yeah, what's it called? Minecraft Dungeons. So I might do some more of that. I've got to anyway, because there's tons of stuff to keep on doing on it. Oh, and I bought Red Dead Redemption 2 online for five quid. So I'll probably play some of that. Maybe stream it. Because so I'd like to do more streaming. It's just the problem is with streaming is it takes up a, a chunk of the day and I've got work to do. So until my university course is over, I can't do anything. That's probably June, July. But I can I can do like an hourly video every now and again. You know, every day or something. And then that way we can keep the channel going. And the hourly videos might help push my hours up so that I can get to that 40,000... Oh, what is it? 4,000 hours I need to monetize. I don't know how I'm ever going to get like a 1,000 subscribers. Maybe if I post some dick pics or something. <laughs> Although that probably won't do anything. That horse shit's in okay, take it, it easy. easy. Oh, I'm getting moaned at. Yeah. Just because I took my horse into the camp. Now we've got to find this Xavier bug. Where is he? Oh, it's him. No, oh, it's Kieran. Kieran? Oh, is it? Lord, please end it. Speak. <laughs> Don't cry, boy. Speak about your gang. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Boy. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I've just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah, uh, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Geld him. Oh, yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. You know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, no you're kidding me, right? A court. You sick bastard! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Oh. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you, no offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. Are you sure as shit was? John, Bill, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right, I'll leave. Off we go to find sure, the O'Driscolls. with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say, I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like. God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. 
Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might... I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me, instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey, hey, if, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Williamson, Williamson. What, Morgan? Just to say, well, even you can't screw up killing O'Driscoll's. Funny. And I guess you're good here. Unless some salt-handed feller comes along and tells you you've gone too far. What are you talking about? Fighting that big bullock up in Valentine? How wise you think beating a man to death would have been? With all them folks looking on, when we supposed to be laying low. I saw your eyes, Morgan. You didn't go clever, you went soft. Uh, I'll take it. After hey! all, you are an authority on not being clever. The captive gets a little cough in his throat, looks at you with some big doe eyes. You gonna let Comb go free? I was fighting Comb when you was pretending to fight Indians. Don't call my record into question. It's your abilities that call your record into question, Bill. Now we go left, the uh, road will take us up and round. Save your horses, we gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then, how are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them, you're out to survive like them, you live rough, you live hard, fighting the law, nature, you're out for yourselves. See, this is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive, we're out to live, free. Combs a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is, Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boys, we're almost on them. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Amen to that. Hear, hear. I swear, this is where he was. Shut up. Okay, now now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. This is it. 
The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. Whoops. You gonna get them knives. <laughs> I said easy. This is just gonna moan about me not picking the knives up all the way through now. Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Come on. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you, strangers? Yup. And Colm O'Driscoll? Well, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The feller that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Shh. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. We're gonna use stealth. That's my version of stealth. Yeah, I know. I'm probably gonna die. But who cares? It's only a video game. People take this stuff so fucking seriously. <laughs> and there's no reason to, it's just a video game. Just play and enjoy it the way you wanna enjoy it. There's too many depressing things in life and things to worry about other than video games. <laughs> Gonna hide behind the tree. stopped. What happened? Oh dear. See, I said I'd die. My computer decided to do some encoding, so there's probably... You know, Microsoft's probably decided to download something in the fucking background, and you can't stop it these days. You can't say, I'm doing something, fuck off. Sorry, swearing too much. But hey, it's an adult stream. What are we doing about the piss or more? Recording. One by the tree. If you're a little chill, chill child and you're watching this, this isn't for you. This is the adult place. So I've got to do all of that again. I suppose I'll use some stealth this time.
our guide up there. He's meek as a little lamb. He better be. Might as well rob them while I'm there. Nice health tonic. Arthur, feller on the log. What are we doing about him? Do I have to do everything? Oh, that was quite brutal, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, now what? We're at the perimeter. Oh, a chance. Chance to get some leveling up on a weapon, so I'll try and knife some people again. Gun to the cow! Look out! Ah! Or not. Dead again. He set me on fire. That's not nice, is it? I know. I understand why they don't like the O'Driscolls now. Set me on fire. It's not fair. That's not nice. I wouldn't do. Well, actually, yeah, I would. I do that to them. Okay. Now what? We're at the perimeter. And so at least they haven't got to kill the bloke who's having a piss. I'll leave you to watch for a bit while I have a drink because I'm going to cough. And you don't want to hear that, do you? Ah! 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 We you on Refusing to die. I'm sure I'm hitting them. Time. God, how many bullets in the face does he take? Jeez. See. Gulp. You all right? Sure. Thank you. <laughs> Como 
Briscoe. He ain't here. You set us up. Come here! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I swear. I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. Get lost. Get lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. The rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See, Arthur? Yeah, I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing just yet. <laughs> right you are. Let's. So let's go and have a look and see if there's a. I, I, I started the microphone before. I pressed the button and I didn't actually, I started talking before I did it. Anyway, and let's go and find some money, some cash. There's cash everywhere, look. Money, money, money. Give me money. I could do is going into a cabin and finding tons of money like that. At this exact moment. Nice double barrel shotgun there, which I should take. Some snake oil. Take the barrel. Take, take the double back shotgun. It's in the box. Ginseng elixir. That's for health, isn't it? Shotgun slugs. Get the shotgun! Am I going to do it? Or am I going to be an idiot? Like I normally am. I haven't found the money in the chimney yet. Go on! Go. Find the money in the chimney. Where am I going? Take money clip. Money in the chimney! <laughs> oh, there you go. That's why I couldn't do it. Research. You got something tucked away. How much was that? Take the shotgun. Yeah. What, uh, what am I doing? <laughs> You're not doing it again. Stop it. Clean the double barrel shotgun. Proof that this is an adult channel. I'm polishing my weapon. <laughs> oh dear. Ooh, nice. Has he got anything on him? A dollar fourteen. Suppose that'll do. <laughs> Was it worth it? I don't know. Okay, boy. Yeah, 
have to decide where I'm going to go. We'll go after Dutch. See where Dutch is. Oh, okay. Leopold Strauss? Come on. Decide. Did I decide? I don't. I didn't see. Oh well. <laughs> We're on the road again. On a horse again. On the road. And yeah. stuff. Have a nice ride through the countryside. I had a walk through the countryside this one. Well, I didn't. I just walked around town and came back. After I've re recorded this video, I'm probably going to go and make myself some breakfast because I haven't had anything to eat yet. And then, and then, all of that is putting off sitting down and doing some maths. <laughs> it's all about matrices and stuff. I like matrices, eigenvalues and eigenvectors. I'm weird like that. It's probably the reason why I'm on my own now, isn't it? Who'd want to live with a mathematician? Nobody. Unless you do want to live with a mathematician. And you've got a steady income. But that's just adding depression to the end of the video, so we're not going to do that. Because we are coming to the end of the video, but we might get there before. Still got a couple of minutes before we eat the hour. It's more than a couple of minutes, but you know what I mean. Round everything off. Because there's that, there's a, that joke, isn't there? A farmer says to a, a mathematician, you know, um, I've got 67 sheep. Can you help me round them up? And he turns around and says, you've got 70 sheep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, bunny rabbits. I don't do much hunting. Yeah. When I get to start playing Red Dead Redemption online, I might... I don't know if you can do hunt, but you should be able to do the hunting and everything. So I think it's an open world and you can just play around in it. I'm not sure if there's stories and things. I haven't played it yet. It's me, John, you dickhead. Remember? <sighs> These people. So, we've arrived at the camp. Better get off the horse before we get shouted at for bringing horse shit into the camp. And I think that this might be a good place to pause the video. Yeah, what a git, eh? So I'll see you in the next video. And I'll pause it there. And hopefully it won't be another three months before I record the next video. <laughs> so, bye-see-bye. Bye. Be good.